Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. I am not in my college hostel anymore because of winter vacations. Uh, in the last two videos, I asked my friends, who have maths or physics, me, kafi acha perform kiya tha J E me, about their experience and how exactly they would advise, <laughs> how exactly they would advise uh, an aspirant to go about these subjects in the final lab. Today we have Aryan. Aryan is a chemistry god. मतलब एकदम you can see he's the chemistry wizard. The god of chemistry. Ka. So Aryan would like to give a small introduction about yourself and uh, how you performed in JE chemistry. So hi guys, my name is Aryan Dawal. Uh, about my academic background, I'm pursuing my B.Tech in Metallurgy and Material Science from NIT K, not Kurukshetra, Surat Kar, <laughs> not Surat as well, Bangalore or Karnataka. <laughs> right. uh, my major is in uh, Metallurgy and Material Science. My minor is in Economics. Just to talk about my chemistry percentile, it was around 99.9987. That is 92 out of 100 marks. So two questions should get in numericals, mm. right? And otherwise also it's been above 90. Like in no, 92 was the highest. Oh, I'm also a co-founder of Flexibus. He's wearing the T-shirt right now, literally. Free marketing. <laughs> If someone wants to, you know, score at the level of like, I mean, like 90 plus marks, he has to score. Can I? You need to know every uh, nook and corner of the syllabus. Mm. 30 chapters, and you cannot simply do some important chapter. As I was just saying, you cannot score this much. You need to know every single thing. You need to have a thorough idea about the syllabus. So, how can one go about the syllabus of chemistry? What should, what, what according to you is a good analysis of the three sections of chemistry? अलग-अलग section को कैसे approach करना चाहिए? Chemistry as a whole in J, there are three three sections as you mentioned, right? Organic, inorganic, or physical. Hmm. I think the main uh, point in chemistry, the main advantage that you have. as opposed to other subjects is that organic is a separate thing inorganic is a separate thing and physical is a separate domain mm. itself mm. so agar if you are weak in something that is that does an affect mm. the other two yeah other two identify karna hai ki matlab what is your strength mm. right mm. is it physical organic organic whatever it is once you identify that you mainly focus on strengthening that kyunki for 33% each section so 66% you can easily score two section to sabse strong rehta hai hmm. it's all about identifying hmm. aur unko perfect karna hai okay theek hai so basically instead of trying to carry every single part of the syllabus try to play on your strengths and try to maximize whatever you know instead of focusing on what you don't know very very true let's say ki you don't have a lot of time hmm. okay and we were to analyze only the scoring the most um, asked frequently asked section of the syllabus so what according to you would be the most important chapters slash syllabus slash jo bhi concept ho sakta hai in the chemistry syllabus uh, great question actually and i think every aspirant should like look at chemistry from this way only ki uh, you analyze what is you know the most easiest to score mm. as opposed to sabse zyada question kaha jata hai all most scoring sections i'll start with आर ऑर्गेनिक एंड इनऑर्गेनिक बिकॉज फिजिकल में मैच रहता है तो वहाँ पे कैलकुलेशन मिस्टेक हो सकता है राइट सो यू टेक इन लेट स्टार्ट विथ ऑर्गेनिक ओनली कंसिडरिंग एनवायरमेंटल बायोमोलिक्यूल्स एंड केमिस्ट्री एवरी डे लाइफ यू गेट अराउंड फोर क्वेश्चन एंड इज अ रिपीटेड पूरा चैप्टर भी पढ़ने की जरूरत नहीं है अगर प्रीवियस ईयर के क्वेश्चन देख लोगे तो तो हो जाएगा इन इन ऑर्गेनिक द मेजर चंक ऑफ क्वेश्चन कम्स फ्रॉम द ब्लॉक एलिमेंट्स राइट एंड इधर कॉर्डिनेशन केमिस्ट्री और केमिकल बॉन्डिंग सो इधर ऑफ दैन एंड ब्लॉक केमिस्ट्री कॉर्डिनेशन और केमिकल बॉन्डिंग होगा टू टू थ्री क्वेश्चन इन ऑर्गेनिक ऑर्गेनिक का पकड़ के आई थिंक सो यू कैन स्कोर टेन टू ट्वेल्व क्वेश्चन मार्क्स राइट इजी वन इजी फिजिकल का जो चैप्टर्स टू कैच इट्स एटोमिक स्ट्रक्चर योर सोल्यूशन सॉलिड स्टेट प्रिटी सिंपल क्वेश्चन यू नो कि वॉट इज द वॉल्यूम ऑफ सिंपल क्यूब बट इन केमिस्ट्री उसने So that's why the amount of effort you put in mm. chemistry is equivalent to the amount of result you get. So Aryan, uh, I would like to put you in a thoda uncomfortable situation, okay? Mm. As as compared to what we had during our preparation, 30 days may in, in a month's time you have your JE mains ka first attempt, and you have not prepared well enough for chemistry. You have 30 days for JE chemistry. 
how would you maximize your output in these 30 days the dynamics totally changes when you're saying that in 30 days as opposed to three months mm. because what i told you requires time mm. right can you say request time so 30 days mein kya hoga? you'll have to really like you know narrow down to what is really important you cannot be like we have 99 chahiye, mm. right 99.99 chahiye. a 98 or 99 mm. you know 0.1 or 2 is still possible uh, the first 10 days must be very you know mm. previous years questions up to down ai triple is hai. Hmm. You know, J.E. means ka last year ka jo tha, shift. Last 20, 25, whatever years. Yeah, whatever years, okay. morning, evening, sare shift. Hmm. Chitne bhi questions hai unka, ek list banalo, you know, first, chemistry ka. Timer laga ke, hmm. you know, solve karna. Then you'll realize what concepts you don't know as well. Hmm. Only those you can go and study from NCRT textbook. Right. You, note, down, you note them down as you analyze and, and answer, and yeah. you just. Search them and just start doing them one by one. Yeah, just do those topics. So let me give an example. Mm. Uh, if there's a question asked in S block mm. about uh, sodium, okay, and uh, you couldn't answer that question, so maybe there might not be a same question that's asked, but a question in that region only will be asked. Similar right? lines. Similar lines. Huh. So if you read one or two pages, that is enough. Okay. That's a ten days. Right. Mm. Pyvi ke lagane. Mm. Pakka 50 marks. Mm. Likhe le lo, pakka mm. 50 marks to 60 marks mm. Next thing is, uh, in the rest of the days, bus NCRT padna hai. Mm. Kuch nahi. Mm. Comment ne kaha hai NCRT padha, to bus NCRT padha. <laughs> right. I don't know why people do JD Lee mm. and you know, MS other things. Chahan, MS Chauhan. MS Chauhan chahiye for practice. Yeah, it's, but you don't have that much time. Haan, time so, nahi hai. To basics yeah. ho chahi ta. 20 din ho gaya. Around 10 days was hindi. Now in those 10 days of buffer time, you can only focus on your strengths, hmm. right? Like you know cash book, you know properly. <laughs> so usko se padho, hmm. saki uska to surely aja. Uh-huh. So there was this guy, let me prove that to you. Mere hostel mein rehta tha, when I was studying. Uh-huh. So Usman ne ka, easily he used to get around 150, 140, 150. Hmm. Right? But 140, 150 is not enough for like hmm. a good college. So J clear ho chayega. Hmm. Problem, uska chemistry mein around 30, 40 aja tha. Hmm. And this guy had like JDD, MS Chauhan, mm-hmm. all advanced books mm-hmm. on his desk. Stacked up. Yeah, stacked up. So he came to me and he's like, bro, Aryan, chemistry is not going to be able to do So I, I said, like, you know, like, what is the issue? He's like, I'm going to solve this book, this concept. Ho gaya. Mm-hmm. And I was like, are you preparing for advanced or mains? He's like, mains only. I told him, don't you think uh, NCRT is the prescribed book? He's like, ha ha, but what is that other concept? Mm-hmm. I said, Two months ka time hai, hmm. you know, COVID ka batch. Hmm. Gap tha, I said, bus answers, answer di padke dek le. He went from 30 marks directly to 85. Just doing NCRT, MS Chauhan ka usne solve kiya tha. Hmm. So I'm not denying ke, you know, organic me practice karna padta hai. But the jump from 35 hmm. to around 82 tha uska, I think so. Is purely on NCRT, uska inorganic me, he was like 40 marks aage. Hmm. Hmm. You know, 10 chapters, hmm. out of 10, 10 aage. Hmm. So I think that goes to prove a long way that mm. NCRT is the book if you have very less time left. Mm. So I think that's about it. So this happens uh, a lot with many aspirants. They are looking for new resources, mm. they're looking for new books, ye wo karo. but they don't do the books that they have. Mm. And I think it's it's more about doing one resource multiple times mm. rather than doing multiple resources. Correct. Ek one, one, one right. So okay, one more very important thing that students do and students should do in the last uh, in the final lap of like will be one, two, three months, they give mock tests. Mm. But they end up making a lot of mistakes, especially in chemistry. I think uh the silly mistakes both with you because of exceptions about sare so many conditions, ye wo formula mein minus del to alag ho jayega. How can someone analyze their chemistry scores very well? The main thing in chemistry is it's not difficult as a subject, mm. but it's lengthy. So you end up like either missing out on concept or making silly mistakes. Mm. So in my time, at least when I used to give mock tests, I realized that there are three categories of mistakes, right? Uh, one, which is the most number of mistakes, silly mistakes, right? And you'll regret them the mm. most mm. because sab kuch aata tha. Mm. Wrong mm. like you know. So let's say you know sulfate or sulfide, mm. right? So these are like very minor things, but उससे पूरा change हो जाता है. The dynamics change. Dynamic changes. So one is silly mistake, mm. right? And uh, the reason that silly mistakes occur is you don't know how you'll pre- uh, perform under pressure. Mm. Right? Solving hundred questions in three hours is something different in chemistry 
Whereas mm. solving 30 questions in 30 minutes. Mm. Right? When you have one minute to solve one question, you are under pressure and you try to read it fast. Mm. So what I would suggest to all aspirants is timer laga ke question solve karna hai. Mm. Whatever is the strategy, right? If you're gonna dedicate one hour to chemistry, one hour laga ke 30 questions karna hai. Mm. Right. Then you'll know ki how you're performing under mm. pressure, where you're making mistakes. The second type of mistakes that you usually would make is conceptual mistakes. Mm. And <clears throat> they're mainly because there are certain parts like let's say a question you know about uh, coordination chemistry or chemical bonding mm. right you might know the coordination chemistry part of it chemical bonding part in that case you need to do pyqs mm. again it always comes down to doing pyqs you will understand which chapter is mm. uh, club club mm. right so that's silly mistakes and finally there are exceptions right jab wo exceptions pata hai to question bahut straightforward ho jayega वरना क्या लगता है कि अरे इसका आंसर तो बहुत ऑब्वियस है लेकिन ऑब्वियसली गलत हो सकता है सो यू नीड टू लिस्ट डाउन द एक्सेप्शंस एक दो पेजेस पे लिख दो कि ये एक्सेप्शन है नो कॉपर का ऑर्बिटल ऐसे फिल होता है एट द डी ऑर्बिटल तो आई थिंक इफ यू डू दिस थ्री थिंग्स यू मोस्टली कवर अप योर मिस्टेक्स द सिली मिस्टेक्स बिकॉज़ ऑफ टाइम एंड डूइंग काम सेकंड इज कांसेप्शुअल मिस्टेक्स व्हेन यू नो दे आर ट्राइंग टू कंबाइन टू कांसेप्ट्स and third is your uh, exceptions hmm. agar ye pata hai to i think nikal jayega good and baki iske alawa any final tips you would like to give students based on your experience i think you were uh, you were like a organic chemistry enthusiast like them sabse zyada ha so anything specific to organic or anything specific to chemistry that you would like to say please try to identify what's the strong area hmm. right? but then do not neglect the weaker areas as in mera math aur physics weak tha right you know uska aggregate mila ke around 75 uh, or 80 marks mm. right, whereas my chemistry mm. 92 mm. so it's important to know that okay, okay, mm. and see to that that other things are are also and uh, the thing about organic I would tell you guys is अगर प्रैक्टिस करोगे अगर लगा लिया द नेक्स्ट रिएक्शन जो भी आएगा ना फंडामेंटल की जरूरत नहीं है मन में आ जाएगा इंटरटिवली आ जाएगा इमेजिन कर सकते हो हाँ इमेजिन कर सकते हो जैसे मतलब इंस्टिंग की तरह आता है ना आ जाता है कार्बन निकल जाएगा इसकी जगह ऑटोमेटिकलीटेंट इज गॉड प्लीज प्लीज जे डी लिख के पास तभी जाना जब आई टी बॉम्बे में सी एस चाहिए तो डू एन सी आर टी सॉल्व अ लॉट ऑफ क्वेश्चन Hmm. He's starting a new YouTube channel soon. Uh, he'll be making videos about his college life and his experiences. He's into startups. He does a lot of consulting gigs, their uh, sales uh, gigs also. Plus, he has he also has experience with agencies. So he'll be making a channel where he shares his experience and uh, talks about his college life. So I'll leave the link in the description. Make sure to check it out and subscribe to him. you will not regret it trust because i have known him for 15 years and there's just something to learn from him every single day thank you so much ayan this was very very fun thank you for calling on this prestigious podcast <laughs> thank you so much everyone see you guys all the best